I told my father I didn't want this either. Your grandfather said, a great man doesn't seek to lead. He's called to it. And he answers. And if your answer is no, you'll still be the only thing I ever needed you to be. My son. Tell me about these dreams. What did you see? A girl on Arrakis. My planet Arrakis is so beautiful when the sun is low, rolling over the sands. You can see spice in the air. Do you often dream things that happen just as you dream them? Not exactly. There is no call we do not answer. There is no faith that we betray. The Emperor asks us to bring peace to Arrakis. House Atreides accepts. The traitor's voice is rising. The Emperor is a jealous man. It's all part of the plan. But our plans are measured in centuries. God in heaven. Get everything with guns off the ground! A dangerous, jealous man. The Emperor sent us here to die. For hundreds of years, we've traded blood for blood. No more. Tonight, the house of a traitor falls, and your bloodline ends forever. The battle for Arrakis took everyone by surprise. There were no witnesses. By morning, the Atreides were no more. All died in the dark. Futures they prevail. But I do see a way. There is a narrow way through. What if all the treaties were still alive? Who would be the prophet? Why is that a bad thing? Use it. This prophecy is how they enslave us! I don't care what you believe, I believe. Dreams make good stories. But everything important happens when we're awake. I found my own way to it. Maybe you'll find yours. Father, I found my way. Consider what you're about to do, Paul Atreides. Silence! The mystery of life isn't a problem to solve, but a reality to experience. <laughs>